Hi everyone, my name is Megan. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you what we bought at Costco the last time we went. Now this is a huge haul and we really don't eat more than normal people, but our closest Costco is an hour away and I really don't like driving with a baby, so we try to stock up as much as possible every time we go. So bear that in mind when you're seeing all this and you're thinking, man, there's only three people in that household. Why did I get so much food? But with that, let's get right into this video. I'm gonna start with the cold thing first so I can go put them back in the refrigerator when I'm done. We got some frozen mangoes, frozen blueberries. We really love to have these for smoothies and I like using the blueberries in yogurt and then it makes it kind of like a frozen yogurt. That's really delicious. Heavy cream for coffees. We pretty much only use this for coffee, but we drink a lot of that around here. I also got four gallons of whole milk. I'll use this for making yogurt. For just drinking, we get raw goat's milk. So we don't really drink straw milk that's been homogenized, pasteurized, but for making yogurt, I do like this. Four pounds of butter. This is RBST free, so I really like that. I make sure that whenever I get any dairy products that I look for that on the label. We got two of these little sour creams, a big block of sharp cheddar cheese, flour tortillas. I don't eat gluten, so these are mainly for Luke, and he only has them for lunches because he takes leftovers for lunch and he likes to just put it in a tortilla and then it's just a lot easier to eat, so these are for Luke. I think we got five bunches of bananas because Sophia eats a lot of bananas. We like to freeze some of the bananas for smoothies and then me and Luke just eat bananas through the week too, so <laughs> we like bananas in our family, especially Sophia. Like, if she's having one of those days where she just won't eat solid foods, all I have to do is break out a banana and sh she will eat as many bananas as I offer her. It's ridiculous. A big thing of brown sugar. We really don't go through that much sugar, but we we haven't bought this for a long time and we were almost out and I do like having it for baking. Honey, I think we got two of these. We got a pack of organic salsa, maple syrup. We got four of these bottles, a pack of mustard, some natural peanut butter. I got two of these bags of gluten-free crackers. We already have one of these upstairs still, but they were on sale, so I decided I would get a couple more. Cape Cod potato chips. We actually got five bags of these, and I've already opened this one. Last night I opened it. <laughs> but these are our favorite potato chips, and they're gluten-free and really healthy. And most of the time, Costco doesn't have them. They, It's really rare that they actually have them, and they were on sale, so we decided to stock up. And <laughs> we definitely stocked up. And then we got two bags of tortilla chips. We definitely like our chips and salsa, so can't run out of tortilla chips. We got two bags of chocolate chips, diced tomatoes. There's eight 14 ounce cans of organic tomatoes in this, so it'll last us for a while. Organic tomato sauce. This one has 12 15 ounce cans. I got my City Brew coffee. This is my favorite coffee ever. It's made in Montana certified. And I've tried actually all the coffees at Costco, and this is my favorite one. It is amazing. So I think I got two or three of these, I can't remember. We got a jar of peanuts. Luke likes to just eat these as a snack and I use a lot of them in our homemade granola. Oh, we actually got two big bags of these potatoes because we love potatoes and we can go through a lot of them. And especially now that Sophia is old enough to eat potatoes with us, I've been really enjoying making potatoes for dinner so that she can eat some stuff off of our plates. And we got one big bag of onions. And then the last thing is something I don't normally get. All this stuff is kind of, our regular stuff that we get, but this was a one-time purchase. I was a little bit low on wool socks and winter's coming up, so I got this set of wool socks. I really like these and I'm excited to wear them. So there's one with like leaves on it and one that's like blue and gray. And this one. And this one. These are my favorite wool socks ever. They're really lightweight and soft and comfortable and I'm not a huge fan of regular wool socks. They're just way too bulky and itchy. And these are made out of actually merino wool. That's probably why they're so soft. But these are my favorite and I decided to grab another pair while we were there. And then this isn't from Costco, but while we were up in Missoula, we stopped at the other grocery store called Cash and Carry. Or it's actually, it's actually Smart Food Services now. They changed it recently, so I still call it cash and carry. But I got some coffee syrups. I normally, well, I actually never gotten coffee syrups since we've gotten married. So I'm really excited about this. This is my favorite brand, Monin. It's really high quality. It's 
gluten-free, vegan, GMO-free, no artificial ingredients. And so this is the maple spice one. This one isn't the Monin brand, but they were out of the salted caramel and I love salted caramel. So next time I get it, I'll get the Monin brand, but this was their second best one that they had there. So I think that's all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what you normally get at Costco. It's quite a big haul and I hope I didn't forget anything. We put everything away last night and then I decided to do the video the next day. So I was trying to figure out where we put everything, but I think that's it. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed and I hope you guys are having a great day. I will see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.